to report back on Shot TV. Once again, they have not got us off the air yet, and it's because Bison football is back in the playoffs. Not only are they back in the playoffs, they are now going to the CI semifinal. We're talking with head coach Brian Dovey. Brian Dovey, congratulations. If I would have said three weeks ago, we, were, uh, we had to win against Calgary at home to uh, make the playoffs, get to a four and four record, and three weeks later, we're gonna play a CIS semifinal game. What, what would you have said? Yeah, we'll, we'll get this done, uh, you know, and, and uh, yeah, it, I probably wouldn't have said it that way. <laughs> I, I mean, it, it's, it's, uh, it's a pretty, pretty interesting run right now. Uh, you know, I, I think back to, I think it's 02, and we were a victim of a run. The University of Saskatchewan had to win on the road um, last game of the season to make the playoffs, and they had to continue to win on the road all the way through. At the best of my knowledge, um, no team in, in CIS history has ever swept it all the way through on the road. Um, yeah, at this point, we, we've met one of our goals, and, and that's winning the West. That was a goal going into the season. There's only one goal remaining at this point, and that's the national championship, and to get there, uh, we have to win on Saturday. Uh, it's Saturday this weekend, Montreal Caravan, the, the number two ranked team in the country, beat number four Calgary on the road, right. number eight Saskatchewan on the road. How do we get it done to get to a Vanier Cup uh, next weekend? Well, uh, it's going to be interesting. We're going to go into a very interesting environment in Montreal. It's going to uh, be crazy. Uh, they're playing in their home field. Um, that's, that's an advantage. And we're facing a team that's really, really athletic. They're, they're, they're ranked number two in the country for a reason. They're very athletic. Their film shows it very well. They beat Laval in Laval. Crazy. Nobody's done that in 70-something games over years. And so now um, in, in we come. Uh, but we, we like where we're at. We like... We like our chances, we're, we're, we're preparing to win, and that's our goal. Uh, very good, Brian Doby. All the best out there at the CIS semifinal in Montreal. You can get all the details on gobison.ca. You can go now, Brian, you appreciate that. And, and I won't do anything that happened on Shaw TV last week at, uh, at the halftime, all right? Uh, finally, with this week in Bison Report, a Bison women's hockey at home against UBC Thunderbirds. Uh, all the details are gonna be on gobison.ca. They just come off a tough weekend against Calgary. But it's going to be a big weekend. John Rep will have uh, the girls ready for that uh, big weekend matchup against UBC Thunderbirds. And like I said, uh, it's Bison football. It's really a big weekend as they got two weeks, hopefully, to play left in this season as they will be on the road at Montreal against the Montreal Caravan. It's an 11.30 a.m. kickoff. At, uh, at Montreal, so uh, watch it on, uh, I can say the station, right? I'll say it, it's a Rogers Sportsnet will be the game, and that'll be this Saturday, the 22nd at 11.30 a.m. kickoff for Bison football against Montreal Caravan. As always, you're watching a Bison Report on Shaw TV.